Oh, electronic arts. Arts made of electricity. EA, yeah, best game company in the world. I love it, it's good. Yeah, Maxis, also good. Loving these logos, really make me feel like a two-year-old again. Oh. <laughs> Wait, there's no changing flag. What if I, what if I, I no, no speak. Hanase masen. There's no language changer. And there's going to be no flags. Well, this this game's ruined. I, I've got I've got nothing to say. I, I can't review. I, I can't read. I can't, I can't fucking read. All right, fine, cool. How's it going, just mates? This is Mr. Charles, and we're here with The Sims 2 for the Game Boy Advance. Now, some of you might know this particular series, or playing Sims on the channel in general, is a very special pastime on this channel. It is normally when I get drunk, normally on scotch, um, doing the shots, um, and uh, <laughs> it gets a bit crazy, it gets a bit hectic. So I've kind of been holding this off for a bit, mainly because I didn't bring my shot glasses with me to Vietnam. They're still in England, jolly old Exmouth. I went to the Saigon post office earlier this week, and guess what they were selling? It's actually quite a nice shot glass, because it reminds me of home, right? It reminds me of um, Exeter, Exeter Cathedral. Look at that, little church. Beautiful, brilliant. I don't know... <laughs> where on earth that is in Ho, Ho Chi Minh City, Saigon, Vietnam, whatever you want to call it, but hey, they had a shot glass, which means I could do shots, but I still needed alcohol. Luckily, uh, uh, un momento si vous play. I found this bad boy. This is the same kind of scotch I was drinking in my teenage years when I was studying for exams and watching Matt Smith Doctor Who. Um, I'm gonna open and speak at, at the same time, if that's okay. Yeah, so I kind of saw this available in the local Naman shop, and I thought, hey, I this is the perfect thing. They also had Glenfiddich, which is the same thing I had for herbs, but I thought, mm, nah, I'd rather keep that as an herbs thing. And then I don't even remember what I had for, um, uh, the Sims busting out. I think it was black label or red label. <sighs> But yeah, I've got to admit, this is my first scotch. My first scotch I've had in Vietnam. It's been all wine, a bit of cider, maybe some beer. I don't think I've had beer in Vietnam yet, but this is my first scotch. And I'm in a bit of a predicament. Here's the thing. I'm going to be doing eight episodes. Now, they're going to be split in the middle. Like You're going to have four the next few days, and then a few weeks' time, you're going to see the other four. But I'm going to be drinking eight shots tonight, and I struggle with just doing one. And <laughs> I'm so scared. I'm actually, I've stuffed myself with pizza and tried meditating a bit before this Let's Play started. You know what? I'm not, <laughs> I'm not ready to drink yet. Let's make the character. Let's see the intro first. I want to show me, show me what you've got, Maxis2005. Okay, I can create my own sit. Let's do that. That sounds good. All right, what's his name? Well, I could call him Ivanpoo again. Which is obviously what I'm going to do. I mean, I'm going to uh, um, capitalize it all. I'm going to... Perfect. Don't need any of that small cap shit. It's all about that big capital letter. Yes, boys. But this is probably going to be the last time I do Ivanpoo. Or maybe I'll do another Sims games. But I know after this, I want to do a PS2 Sims game. Um, whether that be the one with the the mum, and then you move out and find Roxanne and all that stuff. Or it be the busting out one, which apparently I hear is really good. I'm not ready for herbs yet, I'm gonna come back to that much later. But, you know what, this is the last Game Boy Advance one. And I've gotta admit, I'm kind of sad to see this be the last. The last of us. Right, I'm gonna be white. Nice and what, yet yeah, I like being white. There's nothing wrong with uh, being anything else. Alright, uh, afro. Now how do I change the hair colour? Where's that beautiful white- YES! Brilliant! Oh, look at this. This is more customizable than ever. Yeah, I think he had long sleeves. I've got to try. Okay. No, 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 no. I need, I need a, a jacket of some... There's no jackets. Okay. Minor setback. We can still work with this. I think. Hmm, I'm going to have to get creative with this. Uh... Let, let's just go for a straight up shirt then. Got any black shirts? Probably the closest I'm gonna get, but you've got any good looking black shirts? 
Wait, didn't they always give him all white? Uh, sure, why not? And then bottoms, perfect. Give me the same matching white. Close enough. Or is it? I don't know. Is there a better white? Is there a white that actually... Okay, that looks good. I'm an apparition. I'm a ghost. Fear me. My shoes... Uh, they can say that color, actually. Oh, we can get as... Oh, I forgot, because Sims 2, wasn't that all about aspirations and fears and all that? Um, so I get a, a choice of three. Wow, really making it uh, stretch across there. So friendly, earn ratings by having friends conversations. I'm pretty sure someone needs an English teacher over there. Romantic, earn ratings by having romance conversations. Intimidating, earn ratings by having intimate conversations. Well, I'm not doing the intimidating one because I don't want to be a complete asshole. But between being friendly or romantic... Oh! Oh, hold on a minute. We never gave I'm a poor partner because obviously in the busting out, the first story, he was moving to the herbs because, you know, it was just like his hometown thing, not really thing. And then in the herbs, near the end, we tried getting in with R Roxanne. But that didn't work out because we can't date a creative, uh, artsy leader. So you know what? Okay, if this is if this is the send off for Imapu, I want to see him get someone. I want to see him get married, settle down, that kind of thing. I'd love to see that as a goal in this game, but I kind of don't see it happening. But you know what? That's fine. I think romantic suits this, even if he like becomes as flirtatious as he was in busting out, which was fucking cringy. You know what? I'm fine with that. That's good. I want this guy to be happy. I want him to have a nice marriage, maybe even have a few kids with white afros and wearing all the white. I don't know, why not if you want to be a complete mess of a human being? Alright. Oh shit! It's... I didn't think Daddy Big Bucks would be in this. Welcome to my boardroom, I'm Poo. You're here to help me make this show number one. If, uh, if you do, you and I will both be rich, rich, rich. Now before we start the real episodes, I've got a bit of training for you to do. Remember, no one else knows that they're being filmed with hidden cameras. Don't let it slip! Alright, cool, good to see you um, having fun there. Jam into the beat. I can't believe he's actually in. I, I thought all the characters were going to be different, like mixed up. We're going to see Dandy Man. Like, because I'm trying to think of all the characters that have been in all three of the games. And I know Dandy Man was in one and two. Big Buck was in one and two. But I don't know who else has been in one. I mean, like, Busting Out Game Boy Advance and Herbs. I know they're not actually called one and two, but for the sake of episode numbers. All right. Um, um, you know what? I think I'm, feel I'm feeling a bit more settled down now. I'm ready for my first one. Gotta admit, this is definitely. What the fuck is. Oh, God, there's a thing in it. Alright, it's probably just to make sure I don't get spiked by myself. Oh, God, that is not coming out. <laughs> wow, we're going for the slow motion pour. Great. Well, I guess it's to make it last longer. Here's the wonderful memories. And here's to hoping I don't throw up the. Co oh, you know what? I have got a paper bag. Just in case. Just in case I do throw up. There's worse things on YouTube. Like. Logan Paul. But um, let, let's not think about that. Here's the good memories and here's to the final Sims Game Boy Advance game. Hmm. You know what? Old me probably would have been that. <laughs> Which I did feel like a bit, but you know what? A taste of home. A little taste of home. I love that. Right. I'm going to put this somewhere where it won't fall over and break. So back in the bag where I might vomit in later. Cool. Alright, so don't let it slip. We're secret cameras. Uh, Man, they even kept the same sprites. Oh, but clearly Daddy Big Bucks couldn't get a good shot of himself. You never heard of a selfie, Daddy Big Bucks? Alright, fine. For your first foray into Strange Town, was that, um, as voted by the people, what, what they wanted it to be called? Right, a bit concerning, but okay. I'll be coming along with you. I want to make sure you don't mess things up. Right, you do remember that we're the ones that messed up your venture. Do you remember that? We stopped it from being Oh, I suppose he'd be rich, technically. Wait a minute, so is this like a... I think someone told me that this was a, um, an alternate thing. Like, the story events don't line up in this one, but it's kind of got similarities. I mean, I didn't expect big bucks, so... Okay, right away. I won't be with you in person. If anyone found out I was controlling all this, it would spoil the show! No, I've had my people develop an ultra-small earphone that you'll wear with you at all times so I can talk to you without anyone else knowing. Really good stuff. Really um, good to know that, you know, security is a uh, high class here. 
Now get out there. I'll walk you through your first day in strange town. Go earn me those ratings. All right. Again, why is it called strange town? Why is that a thing? Oh, dear Lord. New plot points. <laughs> Press start. All right. Maybe I, or maybe I'll walk around first. Is this my house? Is this where I live? Gotta say, love is quite familiar at the moment. Although, oh Jesus, that's different. Alright, well, R1, I'm using the control, I don't want to use the keys if I can help it. Makes a strange sound. Well, well, what objectives do we have? It all began. Well, technically not. Go upstairs and explore the town. Seems easy. Oh, okay. Emperor Zizzle. Is this where the Zizzle beans came from? Or beads, sorry. Behold! Alien Emperor Zizzle, the feared, the reviled, the loathed, the canny, the misunderstood, the unintelligible. Cool. Purple. Purple doesn't have loads of capital letters and shit in it. A bit of little off-world dirt. Purple is one hot-tempered extraterrestrial. Fortunately, it's very easy to understand. Are you just going to give me a... Oh, my God. Sorry, I didn't realize this was a creepypasta. Um, what the fuck is... Why is Patrick Starr the demon child in this game? Okay. Ooh. Okay, well, clearly seeing some, um... Of, of Ava Kedavra. Really? Are we really doing this, a spin on? You know, JK Rowling already did this shit. Alright, look, look. I know, I know I should play the game. But considering my main priority in all this is to get um, I'm a Poo a wife. I want to see what his prospects are. And prospect one and two, very sexy. Very handsome. Alright, era, smart, sassy, and bored daughter of local gangster. Well, I don't want to get killed. Obviously, if I can date Bigfoot, I will. Uh, I actually kind of like Ava Kadar. If, if we can do the romance thing, I really hope, but I have my doubts. Ava looks cool. I wouldn't mind Ava being the girl of I'm a Pooh's dreams. Uh, nothing against the gays. I want I, I'm Pooh to be a, a straight guy. Frankie Fusili. He looks dangerous. Dusty Hog! What have you done to your glasses, man? What's up? You look like a nerd now, you weirdo. Kissimmee Mezzo Alto! Huh. Well, now he's just a shady... Well, good to see him about again, I guess. Jimmy the Neck. Well, I mean, uh, is that because he has such a big neck? Jebediah Jerky. Jebediah lives in a strange town longer than the place has had its name. He's trying to keep his farm alive, but to tell the truth, he can't remember what he used to grow. Alright, I'm guessing this is my Uncle John or whatever. Except not my uncle, obviously, just a Shoo-in. Honest Jackson. Not to be confused with Michael Jackson. Kaylee Wintercrest. Intelligent, enigmatic, egotistical, irresistible. And she looks like she's fucking lost, you know, fucking puppy die. I, I think I can resist this. Uh, many have tried to woo this brilliant nuclear scientist. All of Well, I like the fact she's a bit of a nerd. That's kind of a nice thing I might appreciate or not. Luther. Was he in the first busting out? I, I'm not sure. I know he was in herbs. It's nice to see him about, I guess. But now he looks like a thug. Mama Hog. <laughs> okay, th that's kind of funny. But we'll see how that goes down. Mummy. All right, well, it's good to have one of those in this game. I was thinking, there's not enough Egyptian uh, representation in these Sims games. Lord Mole. Okay, begin to see there's a lot of a fantasy element going on here. I is this the part where Maxis and EA games were like, well, Sims isn't really made for adults, it's for children, and they started adding these zany characters. Misty Waters! Oh, okay. You look terrible in this game. Your hair's all over the place. One time lifeguard turned fitness guru, Misty is in strange time to live large and scout locations for a new business. Well, to be fair, I think... I, I, you're more one of those girls I, ha I, I, I couldn't do for the life of me because you're too much of a man. That kind of thing. Ever seen Euro Trip? Kind of like that, except they don't end up screwing each other. And there's no way that, uh, that there's going to be any brother-sister thing going on here. Optimum Alfred. Okay, I'm getting really concerned about some of these things. Penelope Red. Penelope is a cool and calculating woman and a mission. Oh, on a mission, sorry. Sorry, it looked like an A. She was sent here by the FBI to investigate a matter of urgent importance. Well, personally, you're definitely my type, but it depends how you are with Amapu. Peppa Pete. Oh, because we had so that says Salty Pete's brother. 
So he actually... Uh, I like that. That's quite a cool continuing to... You know, I thought it was be a let's play. All that's me is just jamming on. Look, I'm sorry. This is just an introduction. This is a prologue episode, okay? I'm really sorry. But I'm nerding out right now. Tank Grunt. Son of an army general. Good for him. Really screwed up his face there. Did, could he maybe, like, mould it back? Sancho Paco Panza. All right. Good to see a Don Quixote reference there. If you ever read that, it's... Uh, Really good book, one of the best. Definitely one of the best things to come out of Spain. Kent Hackett, Tristan Legend, and Yeti. Bigfoot's high altitude cousin. Right. Noticing there's not many girls in this game. Like, my prospects are Penelope Red. Kinda. Uh, Misty, no. Uh, <laughs> I'm not dating D Dusty Hogg's mum. Kaylee Wintercrest, which... Maybe I'm I'm in two minds about Kaylee. Uh, uh, obviously, Jimmy the Neck is a maybe. Uh, fucking Ava Kadavra, which I think is going to be my person that to go to. And then Araf was there's just no one to have a romantic interest in this, is there? Shifted gears and spends most of her time tending and talking to plants in her greenhouse. Well, that is a bit crazy, but again. I don't, I'm not really sport for choice here. So if a romantic... Oh, you know what? Before we forget, what, what's the rest of the things here? So we've got props. I'm guessing this is stuff I can sell. Empty chug chug cola cans. Yeah, the garbage I can collect. And then I've got an item sting there. Uh, skills are a bit different. What the fuck is going on here? So I've got confidence, mechanical strength, personality, hotness, intel intellect. Well, I mean, they're mixing up. That's different. Then you get certain skill. Okay. Right, I mean, it seems self-explanatory enough. So I guess next time, we're going to be going upstairs and seeing what the fuck is this game about? What the fuck are we doing with ourselves? But if you want to play the game, so see if you can find out if you can be romantic with someone. Maybe go for a character that's actually wearing a nice uh, set of clothes. There'll be a link to the game in the description down below. Without further ado, do for a bit of scratch chance. It's time. See ya!